Welcome back to this channel. Let's continue with our full course in AutoCAD for mechanical engineering. This is lesson number six. In this lesson, we'll learn how can we use the modify command. The modify command are all these here. Starts from the move and then goes to bring to front. Let's start with the first one, which is copy. I mean move. Click there to activate the command and then select the object that you want to move. Let's click there, this uh, first one here, select, enter, then specify the base point, just click there, and then move. The next one is uh, copy, copy is to copy the object, just click there, select the object that I want to copy, we'll just click this one here, and then enter, and then click the base point where you want to copy, click there, and then move. If you want to copy more, just continue, click, continue, click until you just finish and then give enter. So that way we copy. If you want to copy all the objects, go there again, copy, select all the objects, click just on the top, move without any clicking until all the objects be in blue and then click. Now enter. And then you can move all, or you can copy all the objects. Click, and then copy all the objects. And then just click again, and then enter. The next one is stretch. Stretch is uh, quite the same with move. So it's kind of uh, move, but just a little bit. So click in the stretch, and then uh, click the objects. Select the object that you want to stretch a little bit, like this one here, and then uh, Select enter and then specify the base point, and then you can just move. So, like the same one, right? With move. The next is uh, rotate. So, can you use this triangle here? Click to activate the command, select the object, enter, and then specify the base point. Just put right in the mid of this one. Then move the way you want, wait to the right, so to the left, and then click. So that the way we move a object. The next one is miro. Miro, as the word says, like miro. So we want to have like the same one, but in next to it or in the other sides. Click to the miro. Select the object that you want to mirror, this one, enter. Now you have to specify two points. The first one on the top, second one on the bottom. And then ask you, do you want to delete the old one or to keep? If you want to keep, just click no. So if you want to, let's go there again. If you want, in this case, to Maintain, you will have to click no. If you want to delete, click yes. You can just do it again to, to see how it works. Mirror, select, and then enter the first point, second point, and then if I click yes, we'll just delete the old one. So that's the way we use so the next one is a uh, scale scale mean make it bigger or smaller just click there to the scale and then select the object we we'll just select this one and then enter specify the base point we we'll just click almost in the middle now you can move your mouse with to the right left up or down depend on you you can just move and then we'll like be bigger or smaller so we are scaling these objects so that's the way we use uh, scale objects so we'll finish here thank you thank you for watching and please don't forget to subscribe next lesson is uh, part two modify commands part two thank you very much <music>